Hello everyone and welcome to episode number 7 of our playthrough as Greece in Civilization 6. Let's get into things, shall we? Okay, so let's recruit our great writer. Oh no, this is an artist. Okay, so let's recruit our great artist. We have two great artists now and no art museum. So we'll send both of our great artists this way and this builder is gonna go build us a mine here. Let's maybe not build the mine here. Let's go help this city out. We can build Hmm, I really don't know what to do with this builder. Maybe we'll send him down here. Sure, you can help Nosos out. And a plantation here. I'm sorry, I mean a camp here. We're trying to build the... St. Basil's Cathedral in this city. I hope it works. I hope we don't get one turn for it. So we're on our way to a culture victory, basically. We're, we're building a couple of wonders. And filling up our art and archaeological museums. So what am I building here? It's an art museum, okay. So maybe next turn I'll take the other artist as well to the... I'll take the other artist to the city as well so we can uh, maybe theme our artworks. We'll see if that will work out. Age request. Let's vote her down once. I'm just gonna throw it down once. All right. Okay, my one vote actually helped. Wonderful. Okay, we'll add skyscrapers for the wonder production. Yes, I am sure. Up next, we're gonna choose our civic. And we're going to go for, so urbanization is going to help us. Let's go for the crystal red and tour. Oh, nope. Or we can go for naturalists first. Maybe build some national parks because we've ha we have these planned out. Okay, we built walls in the city. Now, what else can we build? We need some faith. I don't think I'm going to build a holy site. We have an industrial zone planned over here. Do we need amenities? We don't need amenities, but we need housing in this city. So let's... I don't think the aqueduct is going to help us at all, actually, right now. So we plan to put our industrial zone here, so we'll just go for it. And maybe we can build some wonders in a reasonable time. Walls completed in Pergamon, Pergamon. It's not Pokemon. So we build the entertainment, uh, the amphitheater. And this city really needs a builder. So we'll buy a builder and work on the medieval walls. So we can take aquaculture with Liang and plop her in one of our coastal cities. Or we can take Okay, we'll take aquaculture. 
We want to get parks and recreation maybe with Liang. So this guy is going to go here. Wait for that to be done. And in the meantime. So. This guy can go to that city as well. And you can fortify here again. Okay. This guy can help out in the capital. Oh, we already have a builder here, so never mind. We just wasted the builder's turns. But that doesn't really matter. We bought a builder in Pergamon, so this guy can go ahead and improve Argos. With a mine, most probably. Over here. Let's see what... Tiles. This city is working. Okay. It needs another tile, so... Most probably, a mine here would be the best option. Okay. I remember there being a barbarian problem over here. You won't believe how long that took to load. I mean, because we're on the Nintendo Switch. So do I really want this guy? A great admiral. Okay, sure, we can take him, whatever. And we also get a great merchant, which I will take as well. The dam in our capital is finally completed. Let's look at our beautiful plus seven industrial zone. Wonderful. We have a plus five commercial hub and a plus three theater square. Which is not bad. Not bad at all. So we can either go for walls in the city in our capital or we can go for a wonder like the hermitage I'll go for walls now and maybe we can go for the hermitage later on okay this guy can move here in preparation this guy can go Grab me a luxury you don't have. Apparently, I can't seem to find turtles anywhere. And it's all pearls. And I already have pearls. Maybe I should have checked that before just taking this guy. But whatever, we can... We can just plop him down here. One more copy of pearls we can sell. Okay, so. This guy has a lot of work to do. First of all, let's get that luxury. we we'll build a mine here. This guy can move over here. And then... We'll activate this guy right here. Okay, we have most of the city-states. Let's take back Granada. And we'll use this builder to cut some more... ...production in this city. Okay, maybe we can come and chop this and build the mine there this builder so I basically have all my tile improved maybe I should start preparing for these uh, 
national parks. I like this one right here. We can add forests once we're done with conservation. What do we need to boost conservation? Uh, have a neighborhood district. Okay, we haven't researched na neighborhoods yet, so that's not going to happen. Okay, one turn walls completed in the capital. I think I'm going to buy the market so we can have the trader, which we will also buy. And then I might work on the archaeologist and an archaeological museum is done over here. This city doesn't have tons of production either. So maybe we should build... We'll just buy the archaeologist here and maybe work on medieval walls since this cap this city doesn't have a lot of production okay acropolis is done over here we need 600 1160 gold to purchase that so we'll work on the amphitheater in the meantime we have okay most of the city states are ours look at this amazing we just these two aren't and i think i could take them let's work on brussels now because that's going to have more impact on my game. I don't have holy sites for Geneva to help me. Uh, for Candy to help me, I mean. If this guy can't do anything for now. Okay, we're preparing the land over here. The wait between turns is getting agonizing. You don't understand. Okay. Art museum finally completed over here. Maybe we should get... I was thinking I get two water parks and I boost this. So maybe we can place a water park over here. And... We'll do this with this guy. So this guy just created religious art. And then next turn. So the game doesn't really like it when I come over here. It starts to get buggy. So I'm sorry if this annoys anyone. I can't do anything about it. I apologize. So we're trading with Norway. We're trading with Poland. We're trading with... Persia and Alexander the only person we're not trading with is the Netherlands and I still can't trade with them but Cardiff wants has a quest for us to send them a trade route and we'll take advantage of that for sure that's one more envoy we didn't have Okay. So Granada lets us build the Alcazar, which gives us plus two culture, science equal to 50% of the tiles appeal, and tourism when we research flight. So it probably gives tiles higher appeal, so... I'm going to go with an Alcazar there. There's a lot of land here we could have settled, but Norway, Poland, I'm sorry, kind of, was kind of in the way. I wanted to buy the... Okay, so we're going to buy... When we have enough money, we're going to buy the shipyard in Corinth so we're gonna say we need to save up for that for sure All the best, Roman. okay we've unlocked the final walls we can build which are the renaissance walls 
and we're gonna go for industrialization we're gonna get our great writer nice and let's move this guy here and move this guy in his place and that's religious as well great this is amazing nice and this guy can skip his turn for now that is a very nice tile guys we're gonna move this guy here move this guy here and then we'll go into our great works section and move these great works of writing out of our capital and then out of this room, create new ones passage. the textures are horrible on the nintendo switch did you see that the book looked pixelated as hell all right so we want to move these great artists elsewhere we'll move them to a city that's gonna have a library soon which is this one i mean a and we'll just plop this one here look at that painting wonderful this guy was trading with poland so we'll Try to look for a better trade route with them. But I want to trade with the farthest city I can, which is Genzo. But we already have a trade route going that way, so no need to do that anytime soon. Let's declare friendship with everyone. So we'll get a religious alliance with Poland. And then we can get a economic alliance with Persia. And finally, we can declare a research alliance with alexander and that way oh we have a spy finally so we found out in one of the episodes that apparently you cannot spy on people you are allied to anymore which is very interesting Out of this room. so as you can see we're up to 44 so since this is gonna be a national park this can be chopped okay that saved us a lot of turns and we also get this here so a couple of turns until we finish that wonder this wonder looks like it's gonna need some more time goodbye alexander i didn't even i didn't even want to talk to you bro all right we'll begin voting so we'll try and go for industrial city states because we're trading with one and we'll go for theater square buildings what do you think and we'll add a lot of diplomatic favor to it One of the nice cities in the world kilwa kisiwani is completed look at that rains with great vigor So, Kilwa Kisuwani gives us plus three envoys when we build it. And then, the 
extra bonus, the more important bonus, is that when we are the suzerain of a city-state, so the second bonus this wonder gives us is that it gives the city we built it in a plus 15% boost to the type of bonuses that we have city-states of. And if we have two or more of that city-state, we get that plus 15% boost to all of our cities. So what that means is, so if you see here, we have two industrial city-states. So we have plus 15% boost across all of our industrial zones, of our production in all of our cities. So unfortunately, there are no other two city-states, it's just the industrial zone. But this city gets another plus 15% to everything else so it is known that that's always good let's send this guy to the other city okay this guy needs to go here first and then okay we can send that guy we'll build a lumber mill here we can't plant woods yet so and now we can move him here. We want him in Nosos. Let's explore some of Norway's land. They have a couple of good cities. Okay, finally loaded in again. Sparta finished building its medieval walls. We'll go for the renaissance walls as well. We can build renaissance walls. Okay, we said we were going to buy the shipyard in here. Which is going to give us a boost to our production. And then... Okay, so maybe not build the archaeological or... Let's go for the renaissance walls for now. This city will build... Okay, let's see how many... We have three archaeological museums. And two... I'm gonna go for archaeological as well. If this guy can go to sleep. We can't plant woods for now. Alright. We're waiting one more turn. We'll build a lumber mill here so that we won't affect the appeal of any of those tiles. And we're moving on. So it looks like Norway took control of this small island over here. Which is weird because this is supposed to be a Pangea map. I don't know like island spawned on a Pangea map. And we mitigated a flood which is amazing. The dam has been has served its first purpose. So the art museum is completed here. We should for sure go for a harbor. We can get a plus four harbor here, which is not bad. If we build another district, maybe we can give, or can keep this for the, yeah, we'll keep this for the entertainment complex. Water park, yep. Water park. The entertainment complex in the sea. So this guy can improve the fish. And we'll create that religious artwork. And do the same here. 
and we can build a mine here that's no problem this city doesn't need the production and this guy is waiting for us to plant woods we have got some error score and we finally finished conservation so we can plant woods now and create naturalists which can create national parks and okay i'm not going to change anything we can unlock neighborhoods now that's an important civic neighborhoods can will allow us to build shopping malls which will then allow us to get more tourism let's build the renaissance walls in here and we'll try and take we have six envoys so brussels is ours Leventa can be ours too and this guy is exploring he explored most of the map so I'm gonna send him back home I'm gonna send him back home and we just circumnavigated the globe let's go Okay, so we can't build So where's the closest city I can buy a naturalist from? Let's buy one in Argos Units Naturalist for 600 faith That's great And then we can build another mine here and improve the fish style so we just got the enlightenment that is bad because it has our religious religious tourism against other cities but it gives us some nice cards that we will not be taking advantage of our archaeologist is done in the capital. We go for the medieval walls. If this guy is done here, let's go for the medieval walls as well. Square rigging has been unlocked. Nice. This hoplite needs you know what just auto explore so what we need to do is use this builder to be to plant a forest over there and then we can build the national park We've just excavated our first artifact. We we'll take a Pericles artifact for sure. It's an ancient artifact. Nice. So I might just send a settler over here maybe. How much the, would a settler cost me if I wanted to buy one right now? 1,280? That's nothing. I'm just going to buy a settler right now. And then we'll work on... Mm, this is our capital so we we want to work on something we'll buy the workshop so we can have an amazing capital and we'll work on wonders i got the hermitage is a nice wonder we can build we can build it over here to give our theater square some adjacency and 15 turns isn't really that much if you think about it we can buy the shipyard here let's 
We'll place the water park later, never mind. We'll work on an archaeologist and then we'll buy a shipyard which will make this go much faster. This archaeologist is gonna have to head into the ocean and go up there. This builder should chop this tile. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to use the builder to plant woods here. And then next turn we can move this guy and <clears throat> so we we delayed that by a couple of turns but I think it's going to be worth it we can plant a woods here we can plant a forest right here as well after we remove it with an archaeologist and by right here I mean over here I wasn't recording, but Euphysis just got destroyed. It This volcano just destroyed every improvement we've had here, which is horrible. I don't want to be a bummer, but I'm going to have to end this episode on this turn. Check out next episode to see how we improve the city. If you have any comments about my gameplay, leave them in the comment section below. Like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.